when it comes to paying attention. And he has a fight Saturday. Canelo been out here, and I was watching him about an hour and a half, maybe two, probably resting, eating. Whoever in this camp is so not worthy or ignorant to rest, mentally prepare yourself, and then war. This man been on his feet through the press conference, through the interviews in the next room to this room, and you're still there? Uh, see, that doesn't say that he has no chance. They just say that he's enjoying the moment. And when you're enjoying the moment, another moment will come where it won't be so enjoyable. Now let's go with the question. <laughs> Always insight from you, Bernard. Uh, first yeah, off, <laughs> like you still up doing interviews? What? Does that really take a, a toll on a fighter? Like how so? Like mentally? Like fatigue? I never seen LeBron James or any superstar athlete go out and party and then play the game that night. I never seen a football player, and I'm good with all the Eagles, Michael Jenkins, all these guys, top guys. I never see him on South Street, which one of the business like Bourbon Street in New Orleans. I never seen them hang out and then say, look, I got a game in like eight hours. Rest. Fight. Rest. School tests. Rest. Exams. My daughter here in college, freshman year in college. One of the most prestigious school. So I want to say the world, I'll just say America. Everybody can't get in. Harvard? You told me? NYU. NYU? NYU is a very good school. Okay. Now, I know this. Uh, <laughs> but listen. Tuition, though. <laughs> uh, academics got the money. <laughs> but that's why we fight and take care of our kids. Very true. So everybody can't afford it, so some envy, some jealous, some say it's great. But the bottom line is she in there. She ain't getting in there because of money. She got in there because of academics. She got it from my mom. I just got the street. You're a smart guy, too, though. I don't like to put them up front all the time because sometimes I need to camouflage. I got a lot of money by camouflaging them. But, but, but listen, the fight game has took a turn for the best, not the worst. One icon network that goes all the way back to Ali and Ray Leonard and the greats. We just gave the, the final word that is over. And a new chapter opens, like closed circuit, and then pay-per-view. Every 20, 30, 40, whatever years it is, man, it's a change. And everybody don't be involved in that change. But we was preparing for that change and that happened. And that's why we're having this big fight and that's why we're having this big conversation. Quickly, how do you see Canelo beating Rocky? Breaking him down. Breaking him down. He's already probably a little tired sitting up here doing his interviews. So tall, lean, bonding. I'll go right for the first six, seven rounds, maybe three or four. It might not take that long. I'll just go, like, really body hungry, like, obsessed with the body. I don't even hit the head. I hit the shoulders, the arms, hit all this, to the point where he can't move. Kill the body, the head will come to you.